Hello students, in this video we will discuss the designing of the voltage regulator using IC723. As you know IC723 is used as a voltage regulator for both positive and negative supports, positive and negative voltage regulator. So this IC is a 40 pin IC. We can configure this seven IC723 in four modes. So first one is the low voltage, low current. That means low if the if you want to design the V out less than seven volt and current is less than 150 milliampere, then it is known as low voltage, low current mode. So first we discuss the design of voltage regulator for V out is equal to 5 volt and I out uh, output current is equal to 100 milliampere. So here the V out is 5 volt that is less than 7 volt that means it is a low voltage current is also less than 150 milliampere that is the uh, low current. So this is a low voltage low current voltage regulator. So for this this is the circuit diagram for the uh, for the voltage regulator. As you know IC723 is a 14 pin IC so power supply V plus and the control voltage both are connected to the uh, unregulated DC power supply. So, next is the R1 and the R2. This forms as a voltage divider network. So V reference is the pin number 6. So V reference voltage is internally generated and this is about 7.15 volt. So we, we have to calculate this R1 and the R2 value. For this the for, by voltage divider law we can find out V out is equal to V reference into R2 upon R1 plus R2 and V minus is v connected to the ground terminal. So V out we take at the, 10, at the pin number 10. So this current limit and the current sensing we add one re external resistor that is known as the RSC. So this resistor limits the current. So and output is again connected to the through R3 to the inverting of the error amplifier and there is uh, one capacitor connected between the frequency compensation terminal and inverting input terminal of the error op amp of 100 picofarad to reduce the noise now we will discuss now we will discuss the uh, now we will calculate the uh, re different resistance values so for that we have to first assume the I isc that is this current is equal to about 200 milliampere and v sense is equal to about 0.5 volt so first we calculate the v out so v out is equal to v reference into r2 upon r1 plus r2 so in this designing problem v out is equal to our 5 volt and as you know v reference is equal to 7.15 and here we assume r1 is equal to 10k we substitute all this value in this v out equation so our equation is 5 is equal to 7.15 into r2 upon 10 plus r2 so we get the r2 value is equal to 23 kilo ohm so here we write R2 is equal to 23 kilo ohm and R1 is equal to 10 k. So similarly R3 is equal to R1 parallel R2. So 10 k parallel 23 k we get the 6.9 k kilo ohm. So next is the one resistor is remaining that is the RSC. So by the formula RSC is equal to V sense upon RSC. This is equal to we already assume the V sense is equal to 0.5 and IS is equal to 200 milliampere substituting so we get the RSC is equal to 2.5 ohm so this is a low voltage low current regulator now we will discuss the second problem now we discuss the second problem 
to design a voltage regulator to achieve V out is equal to 5 volt and output current is equal to 200 milliampere. As you know, the IC723 provides the 150 milliampere current. Here, the low output current is 200 milliampere. That means the it is high current. But V out is again here 5 volt, so this is the low voltage. So this type of regulator is known as the low voltage high current type of regulator. So again, this circuit diagram or for the uh, for the this type of voltage regulator is like this. So here the as we oh, oh, here we increase the current capability. So 200 uh, that is 200 milliampere. So we have to add one transistor to enhance or to increase the current capability of the IC. So first again we calculate the resistance value R1, R2, again RSC and R3 in the same fashion in the last previous example. So we first calculate here, we uh, they calculate the R1 and R2. So as you know the equation for the V out is equal to V reference into R2 upon R1 plus R2. So 5 is equal to V reference is again 7.15 into R2 upon 2. Point. Here we assume R1 is 2.2k. So 2.2 plus R2. So we get the R2 value is equal to 5.1 kilo ohm. So now we calculate the R3. R3 is equal to R1 parallel R2. So this is equal to 1.5 kilo ohm. Now we calculate the RSC. For that formula is V sense by RSC. So already we assume initially in the problem V sense is equal to 0.5 volt and RSC is equal to 200 milliampere. So by substituting these values we get RSC is equal to 2.5 ohm. Now by calculating all this value, now we calculate the uh, selection criteria for the transistor. So selection criteria for the transistor is to first find the power dissipation. So how much power is dissipated in this transistor. So as you know power is equal to V into I and this is Q3 transistor. So we write here VC3 into IC3 but VC is nothing but the V in minus V out into IC3. So here V in we assume V in is equal to 12 volt. So we write substitute all this value in this equation and we get the power dissipation in this transistor is about 1.4 watt. Now we calculate the current amplification factor. This is NPN transistor so beta. So beta is equal to IC upon IB. So IC is nothing but the load current. So IL or I output current. So IL upon IB is equal to here we take the value oh, uh, IL is given in the problem that is 200 milliampere and here we assume the IB is equal to 100 milliampere so we get the beta is equal to 2. So select the transistor with power dissipation is less greater than or equal to 1.4 watt and beta is greater than equal to 2. Now we calculate the RL. Uh, RL by Ohm's law, RL is equal to V out by RL. So, as you know, V out is equal to 5 volt and IL is 200 or I naught is 200 milliampere. So, we get here the 25 ohm. So, in this way, we can design any configuration of the voltage regulator using IC723. Thank you.